My dear viewers, welcome to this reading. This is a money reading for all Geminis. Your money, Gemini, your finances, your work, your career for August 2023. I apologize for it being a bit late. I'll make sure that December, uh, September 1 is early. I um, hope you will enjoy this reading and helps and guides you in understanding where you're at and what's coming. So let's have a look, August, for all Gemini, the truth about their work, career, money, and the card has fallen inside. Okay, this is all about, I'll just put my glasses on, my dear viewers. Uh, it says inside, open the third eye to strengthen your intuition. It's like your higher self wants to tell you something. I feel like there's movement, there is some sort of... Um, freedom uh, in which you are probably missing out on or not aware of something they're trying to tell you but there are certainly successes coming and it's to do with freedom so open your third eye and 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 look deeper into what is and we'll find out more let's see what else i tell you my dear gemini let's have a look work career money and we have wisdom yes oh my goodness this is twice saying now, wisdom is about using your intellect and your inner um, wisdom, inner intuition, insight, intuition, third eye, opening that up and listening to something inside you that's saying yes or no. You might be um, doing something and there's always this, this voice that says, you know, do this. And you think, no, no, I'm not ready. I can't do that. And it's saying, yes, go ahead, do it. Or maybe you want to do something and saying no, it could be the opposite. But there is something within you that's calling out and you've got to pay attention because it doubled up. That means this is really intense. Something you need to know, something from within is calling you to pay attention to something important that you've got to know. Okay, let's have a look at the what else you need to know. We're going to take two cards for all Gemini for August, money, work, career. We've got the first one. Okay, we've got too many. Wait a minute. That's the first one. Ornaments. And the second one. Oops. And here we go. It's the clock. And the clock, or the watch rather, the watch. First I'll talk about the ornament and then the watch. I'll just put my glasses on. Um, this shows that there is extra money coming your way mature investment celebration but you're celebrating something like extra money maybe this is to do with this intuition something it's hidden from you it could be also about careers and work in regard to retail or beauty um you know trying to finish work early or retirement it could be connected to retirement it could be connected to celebrating an ending of something it could be celebrating a new beginning it could be celebrating extra money but this could be in regard to your intuition maybe they're letting you know that you'll be do well do you'll be doing well in careers such as retail or beauty or you know anything uh, to do with decoration or beauty okay the time the watch is all about it's time to profit now divine timing now in your money seize the moment take advantage of the moment so whatever your intuition is trying to tell you it's trying to say to you that it's time you you took advantage of some situations that you can and improve your money big money coming your way again careers here in regard to um you know, you've been waiting for something. It looks like you've been waiting for something. And this waiting is coming to an end. There may be temporary work. There may be, you might be even leaving one job. Uh, and it's because you're destined to do something else. That could be taking place now. But divine uh, timing in your money right now. Let's have a look at uh, five major impacts that will impact you. Uh, impact your money for August. Money work. Oh, 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 sorry. Money work career. Bear with me. Everything fell apart. I'll just get these cards without stopping it. Oh, it's only one. Okay. I thought many of them fell. But no, it's just one. Okay. Um, both of them were pretty good, but I won't take them until I'm certain that they do belong in the reading. One was Justice, the other one was the Ten of Cups. Let's just have a look. Four or five impacts for all Gemini. Money, work, career related. Now, let's have a look. Okay, so you're leaving. It does look like you're leaving a situation where there could be some truth uh, causing you some havoc or you're not happy, there's issues. You're leaving, going towards the light somewhere better. Um, there is a lot of money coming. Wow, a large sum of money, unexpected, comes. This is big money where you can buy real estate, you can do so much. This is coming 
out of nowhere, like very um, unexpected. We have um, the King of Cups, someone of water energy, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. This money could be coming from this person, possibly. Or this person could be assisting you to do something, um, you know, like um, they could be the cause of you moving to something or taking action in regard, playing a lot of perhaps. They might suggest to play a lot of a lottery or join with you and then this money comes. Just a, a possibility, uh, hypothetical speaking. The next thing is uh, a cycle of time comes where you are free, free to, to do whatever you want. Freedom is going to be yours. Wow, that's beautiful. One more. And we have something is ending. Something, it's to do with this way you're leaving. Um, it's reached an impasse where there's nothing more you can do. This is a situation where it's trouble now. It's causing you um, losses and you're going, you're leaving. What you don't see happening is abundance is going to be there. Coming your way, a lot of nurturing power, a lot of abundance coming uh, from the universe and your guiding angels for you. Let's have a look and see what else you need to know before we clarify the cards the truth for all gemini okay we've got you are stronger than you know you need to know that you are much stronger than you give yourself credit for so there be uh, be aware of that be mindful of that your emotions could be you could be getting emotional um and it might be a situation where you might need uh, some time off maybe because of emotional matters Okay, let's have a look, see what else. We'll, uh, we'll find out what the emotions are all about. The truth for all, Gemini. One. Okay, you need to... Oh, here we go. Movement. I knew this was going to come. There's some movement you're going. You're taking... You're, okay, the horse is all about freedom and movement. So we've got freedom is yours. You are free to go. You are going to heal and you're moving. You're going. You are setting sail and going towards a better place, a better... Uh, situation a, a better uh, location even time for a deep dive you need to dive in and understand what's making you feel unhappy and there's going to be healing healing is coming maybe emotionally you're unhappy emotionally you are unstable i feel like that's going to change with the um the nurturing power here that's going to give you happiness and uh everything else that shows that you are um cared for and nurtured now, let's have a look what else you need to know. Gemini, oh, I'm not cutting well today. What's wrong with me? Gemini, all this money. Okay, let's have a look at what these cards are saying. Now, it says here that miracles are going to take place. Miracles. Expect the wondrous to emerge so there's going to be a lot of miracles coming your way expect that and one of them is going to be this one here because this is like life-changing money unexpected out of the blue comes to you it could be a windfall could be inheritance but it's there and it's for you it says overcoming obstacles you can overcome anything that's how strong you are they say you are very strong you are much stronger than you know you will be able to overcome any obstacle so you don't have to worry about that now, what I want to know is to see exactly what's happening. Now we are going to find out why are you leaving first and where you're heading. If they would like to tell us with the Six of Swords for all Gemini, what is going on? Okay, so um, it shows to me that you are destined for expansion. There could be a fire energy helping you, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. I feel like you are determined and relentless. You're moving forward and you're expanding and getting exactly what you need as soon as you leave. What you don't see happening, coming money owing to you is coming, but be careful, pay attention to detail so that you don't make any mistakes. Let's have a look at the, um, oh, judge again, this open. It opened before, it opened now again. Justice is going to be yours when you're leaving. When there's issues with money, money owing to you is going to be paid off. And if there's a lawsuit or any injustice, justice will prevail and it's going to be in your favor. Remember that. Let's have a look at the Four of Pentacles for all Gemini. What's going on with this? A new beginning that is going to give you a lot of growth and a lot of happiness and a lot of expansion like we had the three of wands, now we've got the ace of wands with a new beginning. But you're leaving with regret, sadly, but you're leaving a situation. I feel like um, something that was suffocating you might come to an absolute ending. Now, let's have a look at the King of Cups and see how the King of Cups applies here. This water energy, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. You can look at your general reading to know what's going on. There's wealth and money coming because of this person. Somehow, oh my goodness, once you leave, do you see the Six of Swords? 
twice, because you're leaving or once you leave, something happens, a water energy, someone supports you big time and there's a lot of money coming. Uh, this water energy could be also someone leaving and leaving you a lot of money. That's possible. But I also feel like this person could be supporting you to move to the next level and then you are going to make a lot of money. This is like wealth. This is like abundance. This is like abnormal. Something deep inside is telling you, you must know that divine timing is now in your on your side. And I feel like some big money is owing to you. It's coming from the universe. It's bigger than like work money. I feel like this is big money. This is wealth. This is life changing money. And it's coming. Maybe that's why they've got miracles. They're saying miracles. Miracles are going to take place. There is abundance coming your way. Big time. Abundance. That is incredible. Now. And this is abundance also. This is the card of abundance. So so that you know, this the Empress is the 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 um this is connected to also I think now I won't say I'm not sure. So inside this is about your intuition is trying to tell you that this is the timing, divine timing, that something big is taking place in your life. Uh, major change taking place because of large amounts of money coming to you. So prepare yourself. This is magnificent. Everyone will get it in their due time. For those of you who are wondering, when will I get mine? And, you know, different people, different uh, years of birth, different astrological uh, numbers, numerological numbers, Chinese years, they govern many things. So everyone in due timing. Do share with me when this takes place for you. Okay, let's have a look now at this freedom. The full cycle that begins where you are free from cares and worries. It's a new beginning. Judgment card is about a new lease on life where you'll be healed, compensated, given a lot of rewards and a new lease on life that you will live a life of luxury. This shows that big money is coming again, confirming it in a new lease of life. There is abundance coming your way. Absolute abundance. You see that? And that's what the ornaments are also about. Extra money, extraordinary money coming your way that will decorate your life, that will give you everything you've always wanted. And the divine timing now, it's coming now. It's right after a new beginning when you're leaving something behind. That's when it's happening. Amazing. Okay. Wow. What you don't see happening is the sun is shining and there's the card of abundance again. So the abundance is with you all the way. Nurturing power from the universe, your guiding angels, they are going to give you the life of luxury that you truly deserve and you will live in a life of absolute abundance and luxury. And divine timing shows it's now. So this could be happening any moment now in life because you are destined for it and the watch is the golden watch is about timing divine timing being perhaps now so do consider playing the lotto there are lucky numbers in this community channel for you you can use them using five ten dollars play august and keep playing every month you don't have to spend a lot of money or you can buy a lottery but play consistently once a month if you can so that you're so that you are in divine timing, you get exactly what belongs to you and what, what is destined for you because there is money destined for you big time and a life-changing money destined for you. So that is amazing. So that's why you are set free. Let's have a look at this matter that's collapsing, the tower, and see what the tower is all about that you're leaving. Um, what is it that is falling apart? Okay, it's part of the destiny. It was time for it to fall apart. You're, grand, you're being granted your wish. One of your wishes, whatever it, ma it might have been, happiness maybe, soulmate maybe, a new beginning that gives you everything, leaving uh, the past behind you, but you are destined for a lot of happiness. And that's why this is happening. This is to do with your wish, perhaps a soulmate, so that you're not alone with someone that you can build with and do a business with perhaps. You might be having your own business, but certainly you will have the funds to, to do so. Money is coming in. Wealth is coming in. There's the card of wealth. It's all surrounding you to be able to do all that. So you will be able to do a lot, actually, um, with this wish being granted and soulmate and a lot of happiness. Actually, what I will do, I'll put the card here, the Ten of Wealth, and I'll put the Ten of Cups here. So that you can see one of your wishes is going to be granted. And it also shows destiny is going to be part of it. And wealth, money is coming from some direction. And it could be part of your wish. Maybe you've always wanted to be wealthy. 
This is about wealth. My dear Gemini, um, it's wealth and companionship, like um, uh, partnership. So destiny is bringing on something spectacular for you. Prepare yourself for it because it's going to be magnificent and it's going to be life-changing. And it's coming. It is on its way. So whatever is collapsing, it's okay. Let it go. It can collapse because it has no... There's nothing there to hold it together. Now, there is something I wanted to know, which is about the miracles. I'd love to know about these miracles. Let's see what the miracle is going to bring you. I know it's bringing you abundance and everything, but I just want to see what else about the miracles. Yes, a big rise in your money and emotional fulfillment. Emotional fulfillment to the highest level. A new beginning that gives you plenty and destiny is going to intervene in this i feel like a major rise in your money is happening big time and i think your destiny is changing you are going to be emotionally very happy and i feel like there is a water energy that is very supportive standing by you just like we had the king we've got the queen both here water energy could be scorpio cancer or pisces that's going to be behind you could be you could be um could be a lover could be a soulmate that you're uniting together and doing your own business or starting something new a new project that is going to be tremendous but this is happening maybe a bit later on but it looks to me like something big is happening where it's giving a rise to your money and it's giving you freedom so to give you freedom it must be something you're starting your own your own business perhaps or you might be thinking of starting something of your own but there is a lot of freedom here but maybe also the freedom comes with this abundance that's coming see this uh out of nowhere money money big money that you can buy real estate or buy your own business this is destined for you and it's coming and it could be the cause of everything so that is possible i don't know it looks like it it looks like it's something really big is happening so this is happening at a time when? At the time of the collapse. When something collapses and comes to an absolute ending. There is someone of earth energy that might be there helpful, supportive. Something is hidden from you. Earth energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Have a look at your general reading. You'll know who the person is. And that is the end of your reading. I think we've covered every sector, everything. The sun is shining and you've got the um, abundance of the empress watching over you with miracles i love the miracles part because there are miracles that are going to take place and abundance is brought to you and it's giving you the freedom the freedom that you deserve that you want to be a little bit free and not so tied up into everything so uh, not only freedom is coming but ten of cups is coming which is a lot of happiness a lot of wishes being established, dream home perhaps, building your own home or buying your own home or, you know, buying real estate perhaps. And this is a money reading, so you could be buying real estate. Either way, it's amazing and this money is incredible. A big rise in your money is destined and it's coming. And that is the end of your reading. I wish you abundance of happiness. Best wishes. Do share with me. Uh, when things happen in your life and how this resonates with you give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't and um, it supports me and supports the channel big time and um, keep your eye out there is movement yes there is freedom you're being released from something i can see that see both of these cards are the cards of freedom so maybe uh, by leaving and the leaving was there twice the six of swords two times wherever you're leaving and wherever you're going after this it's going to give you freedom you so don't be regretting it because you're regretting leaving but no be mindful that destiny is taking you to a place where you are going to have your freedom and i know gemini they love to be free they don't like to be tied down too much so i feel like the miracles of releasing you are taking place i wish you abundance of blessings namaste